Family Drug Support is a national organisation and essentially we support families and friends of those affected by alcohol and other drug use. I came to Family Drug Support actually as one of those family members and now I'm part of the team running support groups and we currently have eight groups in South Australia, one at Hallett Cove, Brompton, Leebrook, Elizabeth and the daytime one here at Theberton. We also run regional groups in Port Augusta, the Barossa and Mount Barker. So we try to offer diversity for families who have different needs and are available at different times. We try to work with families with what they're going through at the time and meet them where they're at. The support groups are a safe place for people to talk about what they're going through freely and without judgment and together with our training and the lived experience we bring to those groups, we try to reduce the shame and stigma that is so often associated with drug use. Well, here at Family and Drug Support, we offer a range of courses, and one of those is the Stepping Stones course for families. And that's a four day educational and interactive program that's offered to families and significant others who are supporting someone with a substance use issue. The aim of the program is to build resilience, help people cope and survive the journey intact because it can be quite exhausting. The feedback we get from families is that this course is life-changing and that makes it all worthwhile. Families say that when they attend the support groups they feel supported, they feel less alone and as though their load has been lightened. We understand that families really are doing the best that they can. There's no right or wrong way of uh, meeting the challenges that families face. So Family Drug Support also offers an Australia-wide 24-7 telephone support service. And this is a way a lot of family members access our services, brings them to support groups, brings them into direct contact with us and that way we can arrange for one-to-one -one sessions. And another important part of our work is networking with uh, allied community and health services. And it's a way that we can explore referral pathways and build awareness of family drug support. So we do offer training for volunteers and it's a wonderful way that you can give back. It's a rewarding experience. I did it myself for some time. It's a, an opportunity to bring the empathy that you've gained to that role. We don't throw you in the deep end, we guide you through that. And it's really essentially about listening and actively listening because quite often that's, that's what families need. They need someone at the other end of the phone who can bring some confidence and support to them and make them feel, feel calmer and able to carry on. Every year we run a Remembrance Day ceremony in which we light a candle in memory of those who have lost their lives to substance use. And another of our annual events is International Family Drug Support Day. And we hold this in February, often at Parliament House. Family members and members of Parliament and sector representatives speak about the importance of supporting families to survive the impact that problematic drug use has on their lives. Families often feel overwhelmed by what's happening to them and in a state of trauma, lots of chaos happening. And when they engage with our services, they feel better supported and able to talk about what they're going through. Quite often they keep a lot of that close to their, close to their chest and being with others who are going through a similar thing can really help break down that barrier and make them feel like they can cope, they can build resilience and be able to get through another day. If you'd like to contact Family Drug Support and find out more about what we offer from our Adelaide office in Theberton, you could visit our website and there you'll find helpful resources and further information on our courses, our support groups and our various events. Feel free to email us or give us a call. We'd love to hear from you.